Hi guys, this is Mark's Tech Vlogs on YouTube and today I'm going to bring you a quick tutorial on how to order the cards in the wallet section on your Apple Watch. If you found this video then you probably know that the order of the wallet on the Apple Watch doesn't match the order of the wallet on your phone. Likewise, there's not a way to drag the cards around in the app or drag them around on the watch. One way around ordering the cards in the way you want is to remove all of them and then re-add them. But this is a bit of a faff and it is actually a much simpler way of ordering the cards on your Apple Watch. So let's crack on with it. Firstly, you want to head into the watch app on your phone. Secondly, go down and find the wallet and Apple Pay section and click into that. Once you're in there, click on default card. At this point, you need to know the order in which you want the cards. So for this tutorial, I want my green card to be fourth, my silver card to be third, the grey card to be second, and the orange card to be first. All I need to do to achieve that order is first select the card I want last, so the green one, and I'm going to select that as my default. Once I've done that, you'll see if I double tap the button on my watch to operate the payment mode, that card is first. Next, I want to select my silver card as my default. Again, if you go back to your watch, you'll see that that card appears first now and the green card is second. Next, I want to select the grey one and you can check that again on the watch if you want to, but you don't have to. Finally, I'll select my orange card because that is the card I want first. And it's as simple as that. My cards on my Apple Watch are now in the order I wanted. I hope you guys have found this video and it's helped you out if you're trying to work out how to do that. If you have enjoyed it, please consider liking it and subscribing to my channel. Uh, if you're trying to work out other things with your Apple Watch, then do stick them in the comments and I'll try and answer those. And perhaps if there's something everyone's struggling with, I'll make another tutorial video. I'll see you guys again soon.